This September, get ready for more. This is American Idol. This year's American Idol is coming back. Love you, love you, love you. September on Fox Reality. There is no doubt that our next guest was one of the most popular singers on rock star Supernova. After making it to the final eight, she was eliminated Wednesday night. Please welcome Zaira Alvarez. Hello, Zaira. Hi. Dude, what an impact you had on that show. They said from the beginning that you weren't right for the band. Mm, a liars. lot of the singers, liars, liars, Gilby, how dare you? Oh, I love him, always Gilby. A lot of the singers who've been eliminated said that they felt robbed and that you should have been eliminated before them, such as Phil Ritchie. Oh, my Phil, I still love him, he's amazing. And I'm, everybody will say that because everybody wants to stay the longest. Yeah. And uh, I'm different. Yeah. And, you know, I know what I can do. And I know that they haven't seen all that I can give. Yeah. And so that's, that's the same way that they feel as well. And um, I still feel like I should have stayed longer as well. So it's all opinions. How do you think you made it this far in the competition? With the band saying that you weren't right, you had some inconsistent performances. Other performers were kind of gunning for you. But you managed to stay. You survived. I was the biggest survivor because I was standing every week. Yeah. And um, I couldn't believe that I was still there too. <laughs> but <laughs> I was excited and thrilled and taking every week yep. on its own and trying to make it the best I can. And uh, I think probably the way that I was, I was changing the songs mm -hmm. was probably one thing that they were curious about, uh, especially Supernova. Yeah. And, uh, and also what was going to happen next. I, I was told that I was very unpredictable and yeah. that that was... You were unpredictable. That, the one thing that they couldn't wait for the next week to see. And I think that's probably the main reason why I stayed. Well, you weren't long. only unpredictable. You had some really, really moving performances. Yeah. When you sang Everybody Hurts, you had this Bjorky quality to your voice, especially on the higher end. And when you opened up, it seemed like you really felt that song. What was going on that week that made you so emotional and open up so nice? Well, that week was, um, it was one of those weeks where you kind of like start thinking where you are and what's been happening. Mm -hmm. And uh, and I, I was, I, I'd been at the bottom a couple of times before that song. Mm -hmm. and, and those things hurt, you know, because yeah. you take it kind of personal at the beginning be before you can understand what's really happening. And, um, and I was hurting. I was really, really, truly hurting. It was, it was a week that I needed to sing that to get that out of my system. And when, when I saw that song, it was perfect for me. Did it, you have to fight anyone for it? Uh, I had to fight somebody for it, but not much. Because it was a slow song. And, mm -hmm. uh, and most of the times, I didn't really choose the songs. It's, the songs were choosing me. Yeah. And because I really like little beacons on the board. Yeah, me, yeah, 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 yeah. And then, and that's how it happened. I just had to wait, and people would just disappear, and it would be me, the last one standing for the songs. And every week, the songs meant what I really was going through at the moment. You have, you know, a strong visual presence. You know, you're obviously you you took on all the guys in Supernova and basically called them old. No, I. No, I just said I was on diapers. It didn't, it didn't mean that they were old. They could have been really young, too, and wearing diapers with me. But uh. <laughs> That was the greatest comeback, though. That was so quick of you. But it was such a facial disgraceful that the guys in the band sort of had to tuck their tails between their legs and be like, oh, yeah, good one. Because, you know, I, mean, I I couldn't have planned it. You know, if, if you know, it couldn't have come out as good as that if I would have even thought about it. Yeah. It just, you know, came out. And then I thought, oh my God, my mouth again. But I'm glad that they took it in a good, fun way. That was awesome. That was, that was a highlight of the show. But, you know, speaking of your strong personality, everyone in the house has a strong personality. Who did you clash with? Think about it. We're going to take a quick podcast break. We'll be right back with Zaira Alvarez, recently eliminated from Rockstar Supernova.
You're good to go when Fox Reality puts reality TV in the palm of your hands. Just grab your mobile phone and text the word reality to number 76666. Receive daily updates, your favorite shows, all the latest gossip, industry rumors, even casting calls. Be a reality star. Simply text the word reality to number 76666 for hot reality news at your fingertips. You're good to go with Fox Reality. Text the word reality to number 76666. We are here on the couch with Zaida Alvarez, rock star supernovas, siren, not afraid to take chances vocally or fashion wise. <laughs> a lot of strong personalities in the house. You have a strong personality. It's probably your best attribute is your desire to take risks and stand up for them. Did you ever have to stand up against anyone in the house? Were there conflicts that we didn't see? Oh, no, I think if there were any conflicts, you guys saw the conflict. Yeah. What you guys didn't see was the real fun. What is the real fun? The real fun in the house. Uh, what we do when we are relaxing, having a glass of wine and coming up with the strangest stories and languages. Everybody's speaking their own language in the, in the house and yeah. repeating everything and you hear voices and the best part of the house that you guys don't see is the mornings when people or the beasts are waking up uh -huh. and all you hear is like ha ha on different rooms through the walls and you're like Lucas is up because he, he's always up with like this big giant ah yeah and uh, those things you guys don't get to see and it's hilarious it's a great way to wake up well let's talk about your style because one of the most exciting things to tune into before your elimination was your outfit mm -hmm. I could not wait to see what you were wearing and I have to know, did you provide those outfits? Did you bring them? Or did the show stylists get them for you? Well, like, I where does say... one get a strapless gold unitard? <laughs> I got so lucky on that one. I was, because we, we go shopping, mm -hmm. but uh, but it's nothing that they will tell us what to do. They yeah. just give us no, an you allowance. No, you tell, it's, it's your style coming through. <laughs> And we just go, and I know which stores because of be, me being around LA, and I remember a couple of places that I liked. Where a do you shop? Of well, what kind of places are they? I have to know. Oh God, it's a secret because then they were like, "Oh, well, it sounds weird, but I can I say where go I ahead. go shopping? Sure. Uh, most of my outfits were out of trashy lingerie. Okay. The, so a, the a pink place store. You have to have. A membership to yes. in order to get in. You have to buy a membership to Trash and Lingerie. It. It's locked. You yeah. can't just go in there and start browsing. And they will just do anything for me and even custom make me stuff. So I will go there and design it with them. Did you have a couple of custom made outfits during the show? Um, mm, well, the gold one, it, it was supposed to be an underpants for mm -hmm. another one. Mm -hmm. And then I was like, no, I like it without it. Yeah. And I just used it like that. And then the blue one. Yeah. The blue NASCAR space suit was Off the unreal hook. with the cutouts on the yeah. side. Yeah. And I just, that, I picked it out of the rack. I look forward to seeing you and what you will do on your own. Thank you so much, Aida. Thank you for having me. Nicely done. <laughs>